Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is the Pages Corner. I appreciate your coming. It's a pleasure to have you here. The channel that is equal to the task to give you the very best news, up to date news, trending news. A channel that is devoted to give you the very best. So you are welcome. It's the right place for you to be. The Pages Corner. So hooray, you are welcome to this channel thank you very much friends if you have not subscribed kindly consider to subscribe to my channel i will be so happy to have you to be part of this family and also make sure you press the notification bell so that you'll be fully informed when i post a new video so you are welcome what about my <laughs> wonderful returning subscribers friends all over wow you are the best thank you so very much for your love for your support i appreciate each and every one of you thank you very much please watch the video to the very end and uh, give me a thumbs up share the video as much as you can if it is possible for you i'll be glad you do that thank you very very much so what do we have for today yes our president, the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, has come so hard on the Central Bank of Nigerian Governor, Godwin Imefili. What am I talking about? President Sinobu suspends CBN Governor, God, God, Godwin uh, Imefili. He has been suspended from office. He has been removed from office. In the layman's language. So he has been suspended as the governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN. So this the office of the secretary announced the suspension as contained in the suspension notice. Godwin Mifili was ordered to evacuate his office with immediate effect. So there is no room for him to dilly dally about it. Leave the office immediately. He was suspended as the governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria. So as I said, this was announced. The office of the Secretary of the Government of Federation announced the suspension. Willie Bassi, Director of Information, Secretary to the government of federation office in a statement issued on friday noted that the suspension is remitted with immediate effect the reason for it was explained he explained that the suspension of the cbn <coughs> was based on an ongoing investigation as well as you know the planned reforms in the financial sector of the country. Furthermore, according to the report, the Federal High Court in Abuja on Tuesday this past week summoned Emifele over a $53 million judgment debt arising from the Paris club reforms. And uh, the presiding judge, Inyang Eko, mandated that the court will not hear Emifele's motion for stay until he appears before it so the central bank of nigeria governor allegedly only released 17 million dollars leaving 53 million dollars in unpaid debt Bassi also had it that a feeling has been directed to immediately hand over the affairs of his office to the deputy governor, Operation Directorate, pending the conclusion of the investigation and the reforms. You know, partly the statement read, President Bola Tinubu has suspended the central bank governor, Godwin Mifili, from office with immediate effect. So, as I say and I repeat, this is sequel to the ongoing presentation of his office 
and the plan reforms in the financial sector of our economy, of the economy of Nigeria. So it's been directed, as I said, with immediate effect to hand over the affairs of the service to the deputy governor. Okay? And uh, the deputy governor, we, we act as a central bank governor, pending the conclusion of the investigation and the reforms going on. Okay. So that is the situation at hand as far as CBN issue is concerned. You know, Nigeria is in a serious debt and money keeps going out. I mean, they keep borrowing money over and over and over and over again with no hand to it. We just hope that uh, the present government, the present administration of, the, of Nigeria, will be able to, you know, reform this sector and put smiles on all Nigerians. Enough of debt, not of enough of borrowing. Prince, what have you to say to this? As the government, the, the, as the president acted in right, in good faith or in in right direction, is he doing the right thing? You will remember that before, even before this administration, a lot of people has called for his head. A lot of people has called that he should be removed from office. But the immediate president, Muhammadu Buhari, refused to do anything about it. Anyway, action is taken now. Let's see what will come out of it. Friends, that's all I have to share with you at the moment. Please take good care of yourself and be the, a good Nigeria that you can. Till I come your way next time. I say to you, bye-bye.